Welcome to learning at the feet of Jesus. Let's pray. Thank you, Jesus, for your good and your kind and your merciful. Thank you for the work you did for us on the cross of Calvary. Speak to us today. Transform lives. Heal the bodies of men. And let your mercy speak for us all. In Jesus' name, amen. Today I bring you the message of hope. And I title today's message, Healing. I'm going to read from the book of Isaiah chapter 53. And I'll be reading from the book of, um, from the uh, verse 3. And it says, He is despised and rejected of men, a man of sorrows and acquainted with grief. And we hid, as it were, our faces from him. He was despised, and we esteemed him not. Verse 4. Surely he had borne our griefs and carried our sorrows. Yet we did esteem him stricken, smitten of God, and afflicted. And I'll be stopping at verse 5. But he was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. The chastisement of peace, of our peace, was upon him. And by his stripes we are healed. And that is the emphasis of today. By the stripes Jesus received on our behalf, we are healed. So I don't know whatever um, it may be, whatever this name of the sickness may be called, whatever it may be called, whatever name they might have given to it, even if it doesn't have a name, I bring you good news today. The Bible says in Isaiah 53 verse 5, it says, by the stripes of Jesus we are healed. So wherever you are right now, I want you to lay your hands or wherever may be paining you or wherever they said the issue is in your body. I want you to just lay your hands there by faith. And I believe the power of the Holy Spirit will touch you wherever you are right now. In the name of Jesus. Let's pray. But before we pray, I want you to take this chorus with me. And it says, You are the Lord that healeth me. You are the Lord my healer. You sent your word in you. Father, because you are the Lord that heals us. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We worship you, Lord. Let's pray right now. Agree with me in faith and know that the Lord will answer our prayers. Dear Lord Jesus, we thank you for the work you did for us on the cross of Calvary. We ask, O Jesus, that by your stripes that you received on our behalf, and by the shedding of your blood, that you will touch every sick person that is praying this prayer along with me right now. Let your healing virtue flow through everybody. Let here be permanent healing, and let testimonies abound in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Holy Spirit, because you've done it for us. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. If you have said that prayer, believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. The Bible says, when we ask anything in the name of Jesus, we should believe and we will receive them. So just believe the Lord will do it and you will testify in Jesus' name. If you have not given your life to the, our Lord Jesus Christ and you are listening to me right now, I want you to say this prayer with me because the only way is in Jesus. The only way out is in Jesus. The only way to God is through Jesus Christ. So just say this prayer with me. Lord Jesus, I repent of all my sins. I acknowledge that I'm a sinner. Please forgive me my sins and write my name in the book of life. When you come, do not let me be found wanting in your presence. In Jesus' name, I have prayed. Amen. If you have said that prayer, congratulations. Find a Bible-believing church close to you and begin to serve God with joy in your heart. God bless you.